Hi everybody, it's me, Nina. Well, I just dropped off Steve and my youngest grandson at our church, and they're taking the big church van going to camp. Yeah, I'm already a little sad. <laughs> oh, we're not used to being away from each other, and I'm sure he'll have he'll have fun with all them kids being around and being with our grandson. I think I'm gonna head out and maybe go into Walmart or somewhere and find me one of those spin mops. Um, I'm having trouble anymore mopping with a regular rag mop. I might have said that. I don't remember, but they, um, you know, with arthritis and stuff in my hands, it's really hard to wring those out and also it's hard on my back bending over trying to wring them out so i know the last time instead of using my mop bucket i used um just the kitchen sink and it was better on my back like that but the more that i hear about those spin mops and i heard that they're you know really nice to if you've got problems like that my youngest sister has one and she loves it so I thought you know what a good week I'm gonna be by myself um, it'd be a perfect week for me to get my housework all done I had not been uh, you know cleaning really well I we always pick up and always do dishes and all that type of stuff but as far as you know like a spring cleaning I never got any of that done because you know we got started on the gardens and now that both gardens are in and, and Steve's gonna be gone for a week I thought what a perfect time for me to just take care of the house so I'm gonna stop and get me one of those mops um, I have been watching TikTok, and my sister told me to get on there and check out some of the cleaning hacks um, for the um, spin mops. So they, there's a, well, I watched a few of them, but I seen one that I thought I'm going to try that one, and it is where you use one of your pod things that you use in the dishwasher. You put one of those in that bucket and pour... Um, boiling water in the bucket and mop with that and it's supposed to really clean your floors good so I thought I would try that I'm not gonna clean today because today is Sunday and before this part of the video I had put on some video that I took yesterday and um, so it's kind of be going to be like a little vlog I'll have different days added on to this one and then I'll put it up for you guys to see. One of the days that um, while Steve's gone, I'm gonna take my mom and me and her are gonna go to all the different thrift stores around and that's gonna be fun because I love hanging out with mom and we used to do that a lot, just her and I. Um, and of course I love when Steve goes too, but you know how it is. If I get time to be with my mama, just one-on-one, -on -one, that's going to be very special to me. Um, I really don't feel like going into Walmart. I don't like shopping in big stores. And um, I would just prefer to have a little mama and pop stores around still, but there's not very many of them around anymore. But that may be big lots. Um, I, I like big lots. I see if they have one of those spin mops. Doesn't necessarily have to be the the name brand. As long as it's made the same and works the same, that's all I care about. Thing I found these at Big Lots. They are called Fit Balls, and they're made of only three ingredients, which is dates, hazelnuts, and coconut. And um must only be 12 in here, I think. Anyway, they're 42 calories for a serving. And I'm gonna try one.
Yeah, I think there's 12 in the bag. So one of them is 42 calories. They don't need refrigerated until after you open them. Mmm. Very good. No sugar added. It's got a lot of good things. It's got, um, it's vegan, non-GMO, gluten-free, and cholesterol-free. Very good. Sometimes I just need a snack, you know, something to um, kind of hold me over. And if I have something like that, it will kind of keep me from getting that sick feeling sometimes that I get. So that was perfect. One of those is going to be ideal for me. They had in uh, Big Lots, they had a spin mop, but not the, not the brand, not the O-Cedar. And it also was, um, I think it was Clorox brand, but it didn't have the thing for your foot to pump it. So I don't know how you would spin it unless you turned it. It looked like they were on the package, it was, they were turning the handle. I don't know, but I thought, no, I'm not going to get that. And it was tw almost $27, so I got a big thing of water, and then I also got, I only got uh, three items. I got these uh, banana chips, and there's also, there's nothing in these either. Um, bananas, coconut oil, it's got a little bit of sugar, but that's it. And then... For a third of a cup, there are 150 calories, but I found out um, last time I had tried, once in a great while, I want something that's like sweet, but not like candy bar, ice cream, that type of sweetness. And like Steve is still eating, you know, normal foods. And I told him, I said, just once in a while, I want something, but... I don't want to have a lot of like junk sitting around the house because then I'm afraid that I'm going to resort back to the way I was eating and end up eating it. So when I seen those items, they're not like, they're not low calorie, um, but they're, they've got that natural sweetness to them. And I like stuff like that. I, okay, now I'm at Walmart and I got to Okay, groceries is on. Every Walmart around here is different. They, some of them are flip. They flip the stores. I worked at Walmart. Actually, two different ones. I transferred to another city one time. But I, I had a total of, um, if I'm not mistaken, over nine, ten years in at Walmart. I worked um, six of those years on third shift. See if I can find them here. No luck at Walmart either. Let's see if I can find one at Meyer. Okay, I finally found one here at Meyer. It was more than um, than what it was. Well, what it would have been if Walmart would have had them. <clears throat> I had looked them up online, and Walmart said that they had some. I tell you, I'm I'm not a shopper. Those of you that have been with us for a while, you probably already know that. I I like going to like thrift stores and stuff, but as far as these big stores, they wear me out. 
I would, I'm the type of person that I would much rather go on Amazon and get what I want and have it delivered. So, I am done. I'm probably not going to go to the stores for anything. The whole, I am going to go home. I think, let's see, I've got to, I got a list to do. And uh, Steve went ahead and got the garbage put out and all that for me. So all I have to do is uh, tomorrow night if I have more, which I will. Because, you know, when you clean your house good, it seems like you end up throwing away stuff. Uh, oh, Miss Willow's looking out the window at me. She's like, Mom, come in. I'm going to show you. Look at her. Can you see her? Let me zoom up. There he is. This is the one that I wanted. And um, it's got the, you put it in here to wring it out and then pump that. Like a little salad spinner. <laughs> so, yeah. Say hi. Hi. I don't know if you guys have ever watched it, but I will recommend if you like um, like Viking stuff. I had never watched anything like that before, but that um, Vikings over there, I love it. I'm in the on the fifth season. It's on Hulu. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to sit here in my recliner with the fan going above me, my feet propped up, got me a Diet Dr. Pepper, and I'm going to sit and watch a couple episodes of uh, my Viking show. So thanks for going with me today and putting up with me whining about not having Steve uh, with me. But we'll talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.